<laughs> Spicy ramen is love. Spicy ramen is life. My name's Ramon. I'm from West Covina, California, and I'm addicted to spicy ramen. <laughs> oh, my love for spicy ramen started when I was younger. As a child, my mom would give me a cup of noodles with lime and lots of tapatio. Fast forward to today, and I eat over 100 pounds of ramen <laughs> a week. Every now and then, I like to get a little creative and find new ways to eat my spicy ramen. Today, I have something special. So first, we're gonna start off with some raw ramen. Then, we get your cooked spicy ramen. Ooh, but we're not done. <laughs> I present to you the ultimate spicy ramen sandwich. <laughs> There's no better way to start my morning than with a bowl of spicy ramen. The broth, the noodles, the spice, they all mix together for the perfect bowl. But I don't just have any bowl. Oh no, I have the Ultra Mega Spicy Ramen Bowl 3000. Look at this thing, it's a beast. It holds 44 gallons of pure spicy ramen. I love you. Mwah. Oh, mmm. <laughs> I can't wait to eat every single one of you. Yeah, ah, I told you wrong. I told you wrong. Ah, no more spicy ramen. Let go no of me. Spicy ramen. Let me go. No. I want to eat. No, you need vegetables. I want to eat. Stop it. Stop it. Wanna... Saul is my brother. And let's just say that he doesn't appreciate the love I have for spicy ramen. <laughs> Saul, get out of here. I kicked you out a long time ago. Get out! Leave my spicy ramen alone! Leave me alone! There's a saying that goes, blood is thicker than water. And honestly, I don't really know what that means. But what I do know is, is that it's me and my spicy ramen versus the world. A lot of people say that Disneyland is the happiest place on earth, but those people clearly have never been to their local Asian supermarket. This place has all the spicy ramen that I need. I mean, look, they even have Bulldog. Let's just say that about 95% of my money is spent at this grocery store. Each bowl of ramen I eat gives me a little burning sensation that makes my heart tingle. I like to think of it as a hug from the spice. So that's why I add more spice. I like to add some jalapeno. Oh, oh yeah. Of course, I add some takis. And you know I have to add some tapatio. And boom. You have the Ramon Spicy Ramen Special. Look at it. Spice galore. Oh yeah. My great grandpa wish he ate this. Oh yeah. <laughs> Nothing in the world makes me feel the way spicy ramen makes me feel. It gives me such an incredible feeling that I crave every single day. Once I add the water, it's time to add the ramen. But before I add them, I like to give them each a little kiss. Mwah. Mwah. <laughs> I don't think of these as food. I think of these as my guardian angels. They're just so perfect and cute. Mwah, mwah. It takes a while to fill it up, I'm not gonna lie, but I don't care. To me, it's like meditation. And if I get hungry, of course, I like it hot and spicy. But I also don't see a problem with getting a little icy. Spicy ramen is already perfect, but sometimes the weather makes it uncomfortable to eat. So. I developed a solution. This right here is my spicy ramen paleta. Look at this thing. It's about 50 pounds of pure spicy ramen goodness. Oh, and you know it has that heat. Mm. <laughs> it needs more spice. 
I can't get enough. Oh yeah. Now it's perfect. <laughs> Spicy ramen is my one true love and I'm so happy I found it. But there are those people out there that wanna break us apart. Hey, Dr. Wen, how are you today? I'm doing good, Ramon. I see you're enjoying a nice meal. Oh, this ain't even a meal. It's not even a snack. I need like seven of these to be considered a snack. I see. Well, that's actually what I wanted to talk to you about today. Be warned, when a doctor says that they just wanna talk, they're gonna try to ruin your day. You have a problem. You're addicted to ramen noodles. <clears throat> Spicy. Spicy ramen noodles. Don't get it twisted. Uh, I apologize. You are addicted to spicy ramen noodles. Blah, blah, blah. This guy just won't stop running his mouth. I'm gonna let you go now. I have a lot more ramen to eat. <laughs> Ramon, please, I bet. Oh. It's time to add the spice. And you know I need a lot of it. <laughs> oh yeah. And I'm not done. Time for the big gun. Then once you add it, it's time to mix. Oh, mm. my head has been hurting and I've been having a sharp pain around my heart. But besides that, I'm pretty fine. You don't think it's the ramen that's making you sick? What? No, I think it's the weather and my allergies. If anything, ramen's the reason why I'm still here. Didn't you say it made your heart feel some sort of way? Yeah, it makes my heart feel full, okay? I'm tired of everyone being against me and what I want to do. I'm a grown man. If I want to do something, then I'm gonna do it. Being in here makes me feel like a silly little noodle. It's way better than jacuzzi, like way better. And best part is I get to eat all the spicy ramen I want. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's so good. Compliments to the chef. Me. <laughs> but life mm. comes at you fast. Last night, Saul stole my ultra mega spicy ramen bowl 3000. I need to take this to the dump. Oh, this is heavy. Do you know how hard it was to make that thing? <sighs> Saul did the unthinkable, but now it's my turn. Oh, come wait, here! Come Ramon, Where's no, my no, ramen bowl? No, 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 you took my ramen bowl! I care for you, because I care for you! Hey, let him go, dude! 